What is up, you two? This is Bubba. He's our Bebe. <laughs> He's our new pit bull puppy. He's freaking awesome. So, yeah, that's that. What's up, you guys? It's your girl T here. Sorry for being lazy. I'm just, I don't know, in a whole different realm of my own. So I got a couple of comments, a few new subscribers. So I wanted to put something together real quick for you guys, even though I look a mess. So I'm just going to put that out there right forward quick. It's the full moon, so I redid my altar. I got inspired by all the new subscribers and all the nice comments I've been getting. So I wanted to put this together for you guys to let you know I'm still here. Still trying for you, okay? Because I truly am not, like, technologically sound at all. So here we go. <laughs> so I just kind of, I'll give you a quick sweep first before I go through anything. I know it's been a while since I put something together for you guys. So I don't know if you remember what it looked like from my last video, but I had a different tapestry. So I just kind of push things forward. Um, my last altar, things were kind of just straightforward. This time I wanted to bring it in. I wanted to bring my geodes in, just curve it in. So that way all the focus goes into the center. I don't know, it's just this thing I'm trying. So we'll start going this way. This is my red votive for fire. One of the four elements. You'll see the other uh, three here. It's my Himalayan rose. I think she's so cute. So I have to have my fairy. Um, the last few years have been kind of, kind of like the dark ages for me. So um, I've been finding that a lot more fae have been coming out since I've found a happier spot in my life. I don't know. Turning 40, like I did in January, I don't know. People are like, oh, midlife crisis, this and that. Dude, I've been doing great. I feel fine. I've been doing better than I have in the last four years, like mentally, physically, everything. So, yeah, it's coming together real good. I'm feeling real good about everything. So, to symbolize that, I made this uh, candle. This was for uh, the new moon. So I'm going to relight this for tonight for the full moon. And basically what it is, is we have sea salt here and then we have some brown sugar in the middle. And I don't know, people do crystal grids. I'm doing this. It's just something I made up. It's It just works for me. And that's the thing about this practice. You make your own rules. It's not what Scott Cunningham says and it's not what Silver Raven Wolf says. It's what you say. It's what you feel. So anyway... Let's get back to this. I uh, lit a green candle for good luck and abundance. And it's something that uh, I've just kind of given up on is uh, good luck. So I'm hoping to find more of that because I have been. And the red is for love, love of self, love of everything, everyone trying to love the situation we're in right now as hard as that could be, especially when you go out and see so many maskless people. But anyway, so I put some roses, some hibiscus, a couple of gems and some cinnamon sticks for sweetness so all we can do is hope right <laughs> so then i have my triple moon goddess statue here and this is from the the ganesha uh set uh the the card set it's escaping me the name of it because i've had this one out for so long i picked it and i just love it and i don't know i haven't felt like changing it so i like it i've just been keeping it there a oracle card so here we go with this. This is more like a female moon, like centered kind of vibe right here. So with the full moon and the clear quartz, bringing it in to, the, to my globes and my spheres. And then we kind of have like a purplish blue vibe over here. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm a really big fan of iridescent glass, anything iridescent, I mean, like my bag down there, I don't know if you could see that, but anything iridescent really just, I love. It's an old spell jar down there that I did last summer. This, now look, if you guys are interested in how I do things and like really want to make me happy, like I will, I will make a brand new video like tonight, maybe. We'll see. If, if you guys are curious on how I dress candles and how I prepare for a full moon ritual, this is going to be a full moon ritual for me tonight, and I'm going to light it. If you guys are interested on how I do things, I literally have my son Lane, like, take me doing things. <laughs> you curious? So, yeah. And I won't look like a mess, I promise. Okay. So, yeah. There's that. That's going to be for tonight. 
and then I have another fairy. This is like my like one of the most like I don't know the cards that just I don't know you ever have those cards in the in any of your decks that just just kind of show themselves more than others. That's temperance for me. And she symbolizes a lot for me, just getting over a lot and enjoying the fruits of everything I've gone through to put me where I'm at today. So that's another card that I keep seeing and I don't put it away. And then we have this. And this is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite Jessica Galbraith fairies. She's amazing. He's amazing. And it's kind of weird because when I was doing this this morning, like a wing broke off the mail. And me and my husband have gone through a lot, long, super long story short. So for him to have a broken wing, it just reminds me of that like 80s song, Broken Wing. So I don't know if I'm gonna fix it or not. It's just kind of ironic. A lot of weird things like that happen to me. So I'm just gonna have him keep his broken wing so he can learn from it, I guess. And I hear my son walking around. So if, if I get interrupted, that's why. Uh-huh, there he is. That's <laughs> cool. <laughs> he's gonna be taping a video if you guys are interested like i said i will set this up if you're interested comment like subscribe do what you gotta do and me and lane will set this up for you tonight and show you how it's done okay i'm gonna wrap this up for now quick check in with you guys thank you so 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 much for like commenting and subscribing i'm like stunned at the love so i appreciate it very much um, you guys have a good day and later on if you guys want me to make this video, I'll explain these pictures right here Okay, talk to you later. Bye